now switch on the printer so press the power button on so i'm going to do the wi-fi setup now for that we need to go to the printer screen press and hold cancel button and the wireless button for three seconds one two three and release it you will see the power light starts to blink this will switch off and the wireless light will start to blink that means printer has entered into the setup mode and it's ready to connect with the Wi-Fi network. Download the HP Smart App. Once you download it, we open the HP Smart App. So in the HP Smart App, you will see the screen where is a plus button on the top plus a printer icon here. So click on the plus button as we are going to add this printer here. And if you don't see any printer listed here, click on the setup a new printer and on the top of the screen we see DexJet Plus 4100 series HP setup so click on that it is showing the name of the Wi-Fi where your Android device is connected and if you want to connect it to it just click and enter the password of your Wi-Fi and click on continue and you will see the connection uh, setup screen here so just follow the instructions according to it the next screen we get the message press the flashing information button on your printer so that is the white light you will see which is flashing here so click on the information button once in the end you will see the screen it says printer connected to the Wi-Fi and also you will see the blue light which is a wireless light on the printer's display panel is on so it's not blinking anymore so click on continue and you get some steps like to join the HP account and all if you don't want you can just skip those steps and in the end you will get a final setup page this is the screen we see that is setup complete let's print so print a document and just click on the blue icon on the top to see if your printer is connected so here we can hear the printer has started to print the final page also you will see the printer shows up on the main screen of the app and it displays the estimated level of ink left in it now from here we can do the wireless printing and scanning which is quite easy and this printer is capable of using top feeder tray where you can use it for the wireless printing and scanning so here is the welcome page that means we have successfully connected our printer with the wi-fi network of our home thanks for watching